Well, hey guys, how's everybody doing? What do you usually do on the island? Well, you know, uh, I DJ around and uh, host and promote some events here and there. And also, uh, me and Nisa, we run a small little uh, Vietnamese restaurant at the uh, Pang An Food Court right across opposite from Big A. Um, that's what we usually do in our, in our time before the lockdown. Uh, but now, because of the COVID uh, situation, um, which I'm sure everybody is taking well care of, and I hope that everyone is staying safe. What do we do for isolation? Well, we usually just stay home. We try to uh, practice social distancing, uh, try to be um, careful when we go out, wear masks, etc. cetera. Um, but you know, most of the time we stay home and only go out when we need groceries or for health and fitness, we would take walks and take Jackie, our dog, and we walk with him. Actually, he walks us down to the beach just like uh, about two minutes from where we live. And this is where we live, nice and quiet around here. So we do get a lot of peace during this time and we spend it well uh, during the time of the lockdown. Uh, Nisa, she does a lot of time, uh, you know, uh, taking care of the house. She's always cleaning. She's a neat freak, uh, cooking, feeding me in my belly. Um, she does a lot of stuff on that end, uh, kind of like the mother. And me, I do a lot of time reading, a lot of researching, following the politics, what's going on around the world, understanding what this virus is about, understanding our immune system, uh, and trying to uh, really understand how it's affecting uh, globally the economy, uh, trying to understand where the uh, trend is going as far as tourism is, uh, especially how it's going to affect our island and Thailand, of course, other countries as well. So a lot of my time is devoted just following the news and paying attention to that because it's very important for us to understand what's happening and prepare ourselves and get everything uh, in, in place uh, for our houses, for our self-being. Because we don't really know when everything's going to pick, uh, pick back up. Praying and hoping that everything is going to be back to normal soon. And it looks like it is. So uh, that's a bit of a good news. So that's a lot of my time being spent now. Uh, music has come to kind of a, of a, 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 a back uh, a back taking a backstage you can say and more priority to just staying healthy doing some exercise around the house since we can't go to the gym anymore for for now so a lot of push-ups and sit-ups and uh, leg presses a lot of walks and some jogs it's good to stay healthy and uh, we need to get outdoors and take in the sun uh, the, the sunshine as well because that, you know, helps our immune system to also build up. So it's good to uh, get your immune system and maintain it by going outside and staying active while practicing social distance. Um, so that's most of our time that we're doing. Uh, my message to the people, uh, stay safe, keep practicing uh, social distance, uh, practice your social distance, practice uh, wearing masks and and you know, wiping down your hands and uh, personal hygiene is very important. Um, stay focused on uh, your health. Stay focused on what is happening in the world. Uh, I know politics is a thing that none of us enjoy, but sadly, you know, in these times, stay focused on the politics. Watch what is going on in America and Canada, in Europe and in Thailand because everything ties together, it's for our benefit and for our understanding. So a lot of my time uh, is spent on that and I suggest that uh, you do as well. And most of all, uh, spread the love, um, spread the care amongst the community here. We live on a small island and we live uh, here basing our income and our survival on tourism. And uh, you know, tourism has gone down and everything's blocked off for a very good reason. And I strongly su uh, support that. And only when, you know, our government tell us it's okay to, uh, to uh, start traveling again, that's when we should do. But for now, we should follow the instructions of our government because they know what they're doing and they're good people overall. So with that said, um, try to stay safe, enjoy each other's company, 
there's a few things going around, like the community, helping the community. Uh, I know that NISA, uh, we, we, once a week, we, uh, uh, with what little money we have, we try to help out and support and uh, donate and make food and bring it to Tong Sala. NISA, she does this. And she hands, you know, there's a few other Thai people that's joined in the movement. And there's always a good lineup of Thai people as well as Farangs lining up for the food. So it's good to partake in things like that. Paula with Seaboard has organized like last Wednesday. You can bring some of like personal like stuff for hygiene for people. You don't have to bring a lot, just like one bottle of uh, soap or uh, shampoo, toothpaste, something with hygiene to Seaboard. And you know, in Tong Salah, they have once a week where you can bring food and donate and give to the people. And I know the guys at Peace and Love, they put together like bundles of food and they give out. So I'm very happy to see the community pulling together and supporting each other through these hard times. Uh, partying wise, I do miss it a lot. I miss seeing people and I do miss the music, but that's gonna come back uh, hopefully sooner than later. But in the meantime, enjoy the music while you can in your home, celebrate with one another, share the love, keep putting out message of positivity. Uh, I myself look into uh, the politic movement, so my message, you know, what I do is very different. But to each their own, as long as we can find peace, practice yoga, practice enlightenment, do meditation, prayers, if you're a Christian, get into your Bibles, and uh, you know, keep sending the love and keep sending the good vibes. Hope you guys take care. Pangan Food Market, uh, our restaurant, we're really opening again tomorrow. Uh, so we'll be serving pho and banh mi. Uh, but you know, if you come, please come with uh, the under the guidance of practicing social distance. Bring masks, bring your gloves, and be aware at all times to keep safety for all our sakes. Take care. Much love from Nisa, I, Jackie, our puppy, and uh, see you guys soon.